Hello, my name is Sophie, and this is The No. Home Secretary James Cleverly has signed a new migration treaty with Rwanda. Keep watching to find out more. Cleverly is the third Home Secretary to have visited Rwanda since the plan to send asylum seekers there to be processed was announced back in 2022. The signing of the new treaty comes after the Supreme Court unanimously ruled the project as unlawful in November. Lord Reid, the court's president, said there was strong evidence that refugees could be at risk of being returned to their home countries. Soon after the judgment, Prime Minister Rishi Sunak insisted they were working on contingency measures. So I'm also announcing today that we will take the extraordinary step of introducing emergency legislation. This will enable Parliament to confirm that with our new treaty, Rwanda is safe. It will ensure that people cannot further delay flights by bringing systemic challenges in our domestic courts and stop our policy being repeatedly blocked. Following Sunak's contingency plan, Cleverly met Rwanda's Foreign Affairs Minister, Vincent Baruta, to sign a treaty with new terms. After the signing, the Home Secretary spoke to the press. The treaty that we signed today builds on that joint work. It takes the uh, positive professional attitude that you and your government display and allies it with the uh, work that the UK is doing uh, to ensure that we break the business model of those evil people smuggling uh, gangs. We want to make sure that people can live in safety and prosperity. And that is why, in addition to the uh, migration element of this partnership, the economic development part is incredibly important. The Rwanda asylum plan was a five-year trial, announced in April 2022 by Priti Patel, which would have seen asylum seekers in the UK sent to Rwanda. As part of the plan, the government handed £140 million to Rwanda. The agreement was set to see hundreds of asylum seekers flown 4,000 miles, where they would wait to either be granted refugee status and allowed to stay, or given asylum in another safe third country. The first flight, scheduled for June 2022, was cancelled following legal challenges, meaning no asylum seekers have been sent to Rwanda. The signing of the new treaty comes just after Cleverly laid out his five-point plan to reduce net migration in the UK. Some of the measures in the five-point plan include stopping health and care workers from bringing their dependents to the UK, increasing the skilled worker earnings threshold by a third to £38,700, and increasing the minimum income for family visas to £38,700 from 26200 from next spring. Thanks for watching The Know. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more daily news updates.